vivid imaginations of H.G. Wells and Buck Rogers never cooked up a more fantastic experience than the Army engineers at their laboratory in Belmore, New Jersey. Banks of instrument panels control a radar installation that gives man his first actual contact with the moon. An amazing round trip of over 477,000 miles. Ready to shoot the moon. The radar antenna is pointed directly at Luna, and the thrill of a lifetime is in the making. Three two-and-a-half-second trips up and back. If you're ready for another trip to the moon, let's go. That was a 180-cycle note, just about like your home radio. It opens up unlimited possibilities for interstellar experiments, according to Colonel DeWitt, who supervised the project. Calculations showed that radar equipment could be put together which would reach the moon and return. If one allows the imagination free reign, many future possibilities appear. Spaceships carrying passengers at thousands of miles per hour can be controlled and communication established with their passengers, for we now know that the Earth's atmosphere can be penetrated. <laughs> 